All right, ladies and gentlemen, y'all already know what time it is, man. If you like the video, like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and let's get right into it. But first, where are all of my gym stars? What's going on, everybody? It's your boy, Jay Easy, a.k.a. Fresh from the Barbershop, BKA the People's Champ, coming to you live with another video. And look, man, this is going to be what I feel like is the best shooting and rebounding defensive, whatever you want to call it, big man, that you can possibly make. Look, you're going to get four defensive badge points, 17 shooting badge points, one playmaking badge point, and you're going to get 22 defensive badge points. Now look, I want you to know this. I have gone through and balanced this as well as I can with shooting. So look, you can't get any more shooting points. It's not possible. You can get some more finishing points. I don't even know that I want, you know, more finishing or what have you. I'm cool with this because the way that I have this balanced, it's, it's pretty perfectly balanced. Now, let me show you something. Let's take some points from here, right? To get to 23, all right, so this is what? 85, 50, I gotta remember what these values are. To get the 23 down here and max these out, you gotta do that. You gotta do that. And then you gotta do that. Now maybe you can pull this back some and you can get the 23 like that with 55, but that's a whole, and then you can, you can come back over here and do this, but that's gonna give you a 70 post fade and you're going to be losing uh, some of your badges. So what I decided to do was go with 22. And we got the 22 by doing this. We uh, all right. So this was this was 85, because we know that this was 80. And then you gotta pull that steel down until uh, there we go, boom. So that's what you gotta do right there. Now just to make sure I didn't mess up the bill, um, I would I would rather just uh back all the way out and not do any of this. But to make sure that I don't, I didn't mess up the bill and do anything. Yeah, that was, that's what it was. It was uh, 49 here, 50 steel. Okay, everything is just like just like it needs to be. I'm gonna go out and I'm gonna um, I'm gonna leave out of the bill to make sure that I didn't make a mistake. Cause I don't want to make a mistake when I'm telling you how to do this. I just wanted to show you guys. I wanted to show you guys that that bill. Like I have, I have tuned it, fine tuned it to be perfectly what it is. I don't want any changes, anything to happen anywhere. Now, the tree that I took was the tree that has the most strength, the most speed. I mean, the most strength, it has 61 speed, 90 strength, and then it has 54 acceleration and 42 vertical. That's the tree I took. Everything else, look. You're gonna have a 80 shot close. Doesn't benefit you to go above that. A 60 driving layup, 60 driving, 60 uh, two driving dunk. Look, just, just ride with me. I, I know y'all thinking, well, you only gotta have uh, what do you gotta have for the uh, for the other dunks? Now I know that you only have to have what uh, you only gotta have for the big man contact dunks a 75 standing and a 50, um, a 50 driving dunk. I know this, I'm aware of that. But, number one, I want some extra, and I want I want to get, I, really, this is what, I want to catch these pro alley-oops. I want them joints, man. You know what I'm talking about? I want to be able to catch them pro alley-oops if somebody throws them to me. So that's why I got the driving dunk on 62. I have the uh, driving layup on 60. We got standing dunk at uh, 81. Uh, we have a, we're going to end up with a a three pointer of uh, we got a seventy a seventy what's this what we got a, uh, this is this is not gonna be the final stats either seventy four uh, shot a seventy uh, three point shot seventy six free throw obviously this is gonna go up um you know it'll be eighty by the time we're done with him um you, you kind of see the theme the plus fives are gonna push me over certain thresholds uh post fade eighty interior defense. 84. I wanted this guy to have perimeter defense, man, because when I step up on a guard, 
I want to be able to affect the shot. I don't want to just be one of them centers that you can just shoot right at his face. Pause. So I, I gave him some. Um, I gave him some perimeter defense, and I gave him some lateral quickness. And then uh, steal is 49, but don't worry, that's gonna take care of itself. Block is uh, 87. Uh, offensive rebound is 80, and then defensive rebound is 85. The highest that goes is 87. Maybe I should have done this. <laughs> just just put the defensive rebound in as high as it can go. Let's see if we take the block down too. Let's do it like this. This is how we want to do it right here. I want my offensive rebound to be 80 because I want it to be as high as it can be. I want defensive rebounding to be 87 because that's going to push it over 95, you know, with all the with, with everything that we're about to do. Uh, blocking is fine. Lateral quickness is fine. Stealing is fine. This is how we want it to be. Boom. Okay. Body shape, I'm going with the find. I always go with the find. Here's the secret sauce. We're going to make him 6'11". 6'11". Make him 6'11". We have a 66 driving dunk, right? Boom. So we can do, we can catch alleys, we can catch pro alleys right off the rip. Uh, driving layup is going to be a 60, uh, 63. Uh, we're not really worried about that. The three-point shot is going to be a 72 off the rip, but not really. Uh, then after that, you know, interior defense, don't, don't you, you, you got to rock with me because everything I do, I do for a reason. Speed went up to 66. We're going to have 70 speed out of the gate as a center. Strength went down a point, but don't worry about that. Acceleration went up, vertical went up to 46. With the badges, uh, you can do whatever you need to do. You ain't got to worry about that. Still went up to 53. Boom. Blocking went down to 84 and, and everything is lateral quickness. But look, when we do this, let's max it. Let's, let's max. We're going to max out his uh, weight, but then we're going to come back because what's, what's the acceleration? The highest acceleration he can get is that. So we're going to max that out. We don't want to max the weight. We want to make the weight as high as it can be. Um, actually, we're going to have to max the weight. Boom. Do we get, did we lose anything from here? All right. We want to, we want weight to be right here. 283. Can we go 285? We go 285. Do we lose anything? Um, you don't lose anything. We're going to go max weight. Reason, the reason that we're gonna go max weight is because, do you see what's happening to my defense? My interior defense goes up to 90, and I only lose two lateral quickness points. I'm cool with that. I am cool with that. Right here, where we are, is what I, is that, that, that's where I want them to be right here. Now, the extra secret sauce. We're going to extend this wingspan. We don't wanna go max wingspan. We're gonna go one tick down from max. One tick down from max wingspan is gonna give us right here where we at. Now, can we back it up? Cause we know block. Uh, I wanna see if I do this right. Boom, there we go. We wanna have that. That's why we got that like it, like it is. All right, so we're gonna have this defined body gonna come down one we're gonna max max this out and then we're gonna put the wingspan up one from the top okay there we go so this is going to give us because that would have given us 92 it would have given us 92 rebounding with the plus five and in 90 92 it ain't no big difference if it would have been a difference between 90 and 95 that would have been that would have been it but I can deal with 90 and 92 on the rebound I wanted to have 90 blocking um you know meet that threshold so i'm gonna have 95 blocking boom there we go this is what i want to go because look right off the bat strength is gonna be a, i'm gonna have 99 strength off the bat because when i do my drills uh acceleration gonna go to 60 speed gonna be 70 right off the bat it's gonna be 75 when i get where i'm going and it's gonna be a 50 vertical so you're gonna have uh plus four so it's gonna give me a uh, 49 vertical plus five or plus another four. We just say plus another four just to be good. So uh, plus eight. It's going to be a 53 vertical. That's plenty. This is what we want to do. We're going to take rim protect the takeover. Is your build complete? Yes. Yes, it is. And this is what we're going to do. And uh, that's the build. Now, what I'm going to do is I'm going to start my career. And I'm not going to go through my career 
because I want to make sure that this is the bill that I want to go through this with. Uh, because I actually, you're going you're gonna to see in a second that I actually made this build already. But I think I made one tweak in there that I didn't make on this guy. And so, you know how that goes, man. But hey, here we go right here. Progression. Boom. This is what it's going to be. Bro, he's going to be, look at, look at, look at what we're going to go. Okay, it's going to be 80 shot close. Shot close going to be good. This is standing layup. Boom. Driving layup going to be 63. It'll, it'll get over 65. Driving dunk is going to be over 70 by the time we get done. Uh, and, and standing dunk, we already see this going to get up to what? 85? Boom. So it's going to be dope, man. The, the kid, the cat is going to be, cat going to be tough, man. I'm not even going to lie to you. All the rest of this stuff really doesn't matter. The only thing I wanted to make sure of is that I could get the animations that I wanted to get and that I could also, um, you know, I want to get the animations that I wanted to get, but I want to be able to have, I, at the end of it all, I'm going to have a 75 open shot three. That's plenty to hit consistently. Been hitting consistently. T. Mizzle hit consistently with a guard and he had 75 or, you know, like 77, something like that. So if he can hit consistently with a guard, me with the correct badges that I'm going to put on this dude, hey, it's going to be, it's going to be on, man. Uh, what they gave me, the, the D-list Mavericks. You know what, I'm going to delete that. I'm going to delete that because I, I don't want to make a mistake. And then, um, hey, should we test the build out? I really don't want to, but I, I will show you this. Max him out to 99. These are the badges that we're going to put on him. We're going to put Giant Slayer on him. And then we're going to put, um, uh, what else did I want? I wanted uh, Giant Slayer. And then we're going to put one slithery on him. Hey, that's how we're going to go. No, 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 no. We're going to put one drop stepper on him. Boom. That's how we're going to do with that. Shooting badges. We're going to have catch and shoot. Dead eye. Corner specialist. Hot zone. Range extender. And two on quick draw. That's how we're doing it with the shooting badges. Boom. The same, shoot, same shooting badges that I, I use with my other guy. Playmaking. You only got one playmaking badge. Let me tell you what you put that on. Bail out. You don't need break start. You don't need break start. I don't need live city uh, finisher. None of that stuff. I mean, uh, thrower. Now, what I might do when I um when I'm playing with T or something like that, I put on live city, live city finisher like that. But other than that, um, you know, if we're trying to catch alleys and get rep, other than that, I'm gonna put on giant slayer because the centers, all the centers are gonna be taller than I am. Put bail out right there, and then on these badges, we are gonna go box. Hall of Fame Brick Wall, Hall of Fame Intimidator, um, Hall of Fame Rim Protector. Well, I got seven left. I might put on Defensive Leader. I, I may do that. Uh, Hall of Fame Rebound Chaser, maybe Gold Rebound Chaser, just depending on uh, who I'm playing against. Look, now we got stuff to play with. Pogo Stick, Chase Down Artist. Probably gonna go something like that, just because I wanna, I wanna harass people or whatever. And, um, you know, if I find out that pogo stick don't work the way that I want it to, you know, we're going to do some other stuff. But I, I feel like this right here is going to be the best way to play defense for me because the other stuff really don't make a, make a whole heck of a lot of difference. Now, I could go, um, I could do this, put Hawk, make those be Hall of Fame and go, bron and, and go bronze on the other two. And I might end up doing that. But, man, what I heard from a lot of people is, is, uh, I heard from a lot of people that box, you really don't have to go Hall of Fame on box anymore, and you can go Hall of Fame on rebound chasing in the, par in the park or whatever, and I might go, I, you know, I'm, I'm gonna figure some stuff out, man. And this is not set in stone. These are just the, ten the tentative badges, right? Hey, the jump shot, you already know what it is. You already know what it is. It's the kid, Ray Allen, and let's just load this thing up. I'm gonna take one or two shots, man. I'm gonna get up out of here, man, and hope you guys enjoy the video. But like I said, man, this, I feel like it's gonna be one of the best bills as far as as far as the whole thing goes because I have meticulously put this fellow together and he can do, he can't do everything, but he can do everything that I want him to do. I mean, even if I gotta go around the guy and go to the rim or something like that, I'll be, I'll be able to dunk the basketball. Hello, maybe everyone. I left my shooting, maybe I left my dunking too high, my driving dunk too high, but like I said, I know I knew what I wanted to do with it. Let me mute this right here. I knew what I was looking to do. Look at this. All right. Calling for the screen. Come here. I did not mean to do that. 
And you know why? Because my dog on the dog, bro, the dog on um, what's the call of his own, man? But it's all good though. Give me this board. Give me this board. Now let's let's come now, court. I'm gonna call me a screen from a guard. And I'm gonna try, oh, you don't wanna do that? Bro, I need a guard, come set the screen! Hurry up, get over here! There it is, <laughs> And I'll be able to hit with that, man. Let's see what badges gonna pop up. Corner specialist, all this stuff. I need to shoot one more shot and then I'm gonna let y'all get up out of here, man. But like I said, I feel like this is one of the, this gonna be one of the best, most dangerous build. Starting off with 90 perimeter, I mean 90 interior defense. Bro, you can't ask for better than that. The rest of it is just up to me. Look at these boys. Give me this board. I don't need no doggone what's it called to get a board. I'm gonna come down court one more time. Hit this corner. Call, call for me a screen. Get over here. Back up. Big greens! Green bean money team! If you can shoot the basketball, you can shoot the basketball. That's all I got to show y'all, man. Look, that's all I wanted to show. Y'all see, y'all see you can hit. Like I said, if you can hit in here. You can learn to hit in your my court, and then once I get my once I get my jump shot right, once I get my jumper, man, I'm gonna um, once I get my jumper, my jump shot created, I'm gonna do that. If y'all want me to grind this guy on on stream and all that good stuff, uh, y'all let me know, man. But other than that, that's all I got for y'all today, man. Make sure you like the video if you like the video, subscribe for more daily 2K content, and I'm out of here. Till next time. It's your boy Jay Easy, aka Fresh from the Barbershop, BK the People's Champ. God speed. You know I'm going to the Lakers, man. Why, why would I go anywhere other than the Lakers? And like I said, man, when you putting these joints on, these animations, I should be good. But I'm hollering to y'all next time, man. Y'all take it easy. Peace.